through the last 24 hours? Yeah, hard. It's hard to talk about. It's hard to find uh, the right words. Uh, well, we saw it a lot of times uh, on TV, and it was far, far away from us. Even it, when it was in Istanbul, in my my, my country, on uh, New Year's Eve, it was close, but also very far from us. And uh, last night, or well, last evening, we yeah, we felt how it how it is, it is like to be in a situation like this. And uh, I, I don't wish anyone a feeling like this. It's hard to ask this question, and I understand it's hard to answer it, but when you're sitting there feeling, how far is football away from your head? Uh, I don't know if uh, the people um, can, can understand this, but uh, until I was on the pitch in the second half, I didn't think about football, to be honest, because uh, last night I didn't realize what happened and when I was, when I was at home and my wife and my son were waiting in front of the door and... There I, I felt how lucky we were and, uh, and I know football is very important, we love football, uh, we suffer with football, we love football and uh, I know we earn a lot of money, we have a privileged life but we are human beings and uh, there is so much more than football in this world and uh, yeah, last night we, we felt it. I spoke to one of your teammates and he said you were very lucky as a player that nobody died. That the seriousness of this injury was hard to see from outside. You, I got juice bumps. Uh, when, I, when you were in the bus last night, uh, when I can't forget the, the faces. I, I will never forget these faces in my life for sure. I will, Oh, I, when I saw Mark there, and uh, I sit next to Schmeller, and uh, I, I will never forget Schmeller's face, and it was unbelievable. Thank you for seeing us, and I will stay away from football question this time. Det var alltså Nuri Shahin som fortalte om grusomheten i går i bussen.